Hi guys, welcome back to the Tweet Gaming Channel. So last episode, we went down to the Abyssal Cult hideout, and we defeat and we defeated and, and we defeated them, but not without losing half our team. I trained up Snoggy and Dry Bones and gave Dry Bones the uh, Thick Club, and now I'm gonna go to the Sonata Tracks and grind and grind for a lumberry. So, and I'm also probably gonna put like some speed EVs on crocodiles so that it can, I can ensure that it'll outspeed the electivire. But besides that, that's all, all I'm gonna do for now. So I'll see you once I've done that. Oh yeah, so now we are. Uh, oh yeah, so so guys, we've done a little bit of grinding. We haven't gotten the lumber yet, but I wanted to show you that you can get this. You you can get this special Pokemon here. Hi, thanks for meeting me here. Look, I've been waiting quite for quite some time with Substriker here, and we don't just seem to have what it takes to make it to the top. You don't wait. You need to race on Ice Path. Ice Path is like the 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 thing with Ice Path is that the AI is really bad at it because they're programmed to do certain things, and it makes them get stuck in in like on inescapable routes. Whereas we're human, so we can change our path. We don't do the same thing every time. Actually, it's my fault, really. Zeb Stark has always been in peak condition, but I'm just no good at coaching. But you, on the other hand, seem to have great potential. That's why I'm asking you to look on Zip after Zip Striker on my behalf and give it the recognition it deserves. Don't worry about my feelings and all this. My family raises Brit Blitzel and Nascatown, and I wanted to give racing a try, but I guess I'm more suited to breeding than actually racing. <laughs> Anyways, I'll be heading off now. Are you going to accept my offer, or what? We it's not like I had a choice. Oh, it's male. We, you know, we have to name it Marty. We have to. <laughs> All right, that now that that's a freeze up striker. Now I'm, I'm gonna go back to grinding now. Never mind. We just got the lumberry. All right. That's a, that is exactly what I wanted. We also got some other nice berries. I think I'll give Deku Tree a citrus berry as well. I think it's more useful than a focus sash. Because it's going to we're gonna need the extra longevity it provides. So we're get, I guess we're gonna go ahead and go into Cap back to Kepler City now. We also got a bit of extra money, so I might as well spend it. And by spend it, I mean use it all on you, on this stuff. Just, just in case, you know. All right. All right. There's, I mean, there's not really much more preparation that I can do, except for over level my whole team. But I'm not going to do that because I'm not. I want to provide quality content, I, so I'm not going to do that. Oh, Paralyzed Kill, that's useful. Alright, so our plan is, is we're leading with Crocodile. We're going to we're gonna hope that... We're going to hope that, that the key that the will swagger and the Lumber will heal that. Alright, let's save. Well, 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 look who it is. The hero who single-handedly shut down the Abyssal Cult. I have to admit, that's very impressive. You have my thanks on behalf of everyone in this town. Lugia flew off after Audrey disappeared. 
The storms faded away and we cleared the streets of all the water. Everyone, everything looks like it's going to be alright, but let's not keep you waiting any longer. You came for a gym battle, right? Allow me to introduce myself, you know, officially. My name is Anastasia, the leader of the Kepler City Gym. The theme of my gym is machinery. As such, I specialize in steel and electric pipes. I have to admit I'm pretty excited for this battle. I mean, it's not every day you get to beat someone who dismantled the coal. I Pokemon work together like the gears in a machine. My, you might have beaten Audrey Took, but you won't fare a day against me. It's spelled wrong. Why is it spelled wrong? That is actually terrible. Oh my, okay. The game just lagged on us. Alright, I don't want to risk Ice Punch killing here. I think I'm gonna switch to Monkey. Alright, we think- alright, so I think now- why- now it'll probably wild charge so that we can pivot to Marowak. I'm so good. We can just false swan. Oh, okay. I'm. Do we want to risk the roll here? Or do we want to just switch? I don't think risking. Oh, uh, I think I might. The, because we do have another third option, which is heal and see if it's actually a roll. I think it's a roll. I was wrong. That is not good. Oh, uh, I guess we're he we'll heal and just try again. Oh, my cat came into my room. That's pretty pog. I think. I think I'll show. I'll show you guys. I'll. I'll make a video later where I show where you guys my cat. All right. There, all right. There. There you. Close combat is way better than cross charm. Rotom wash. All right, now we're in a very bad position. But we know, we know it won't go for an electric move. I think I'm gonna switch to Decker Tree and hope for the best. All right, here we can just wood hammer. Citrus Berry saved our life. Is all right. E just lost. All right, we can expect a Shadow Ball here. It can't really hit Flygon Bait. Okay. Yeah, Shadow Seek does make sense. All right, King Shield. I didn't want to read a King Shield. All right. I think we can just crunch here, because it can't kill Flygon Bait. And now we just Earthquake, and it's dead. This is how- Alright, no deaths so far. This is going well. Alright, Metagru- Alright, I think a good play here might just be seeing how much damage it does. Or if it misses, or something like that. Because right, right now, we have the optimal Pokemon out against the Metagross. We actually got a miss. Oh. Oh my god. It lived. It lived plus one Earthquake. We're, this is this is not a very good position, not gonna lie. Wait, we have Focus Ash Mag- We still have Focus Ash Mag Cargo, though. So we can expect a bullet punch here. Alright, so which Pokemon has Antistasia not used yet? I might actually- I'm gonna open the wiki guide real quick. 
I think she's so she switched down Aegis Slash. Okay, that's what she did. We need to we need to make a sack in order to win. Probably pro probably dry bones is the best sack. Sorry, dry bones. Okay, this puts us in a very bad position. We might have to fish for a miss now, or thunder wave screech, or do something crazy. Do something crazy like that. I think we'd have to thunder wave screech. It crit critting dry bones was very bad. Yeah, we're we're gonna we're gonna do the thunder wave screech strats. So we know it lives plus one earthquake, but it can't live plus two earthquake. Because we saw how close that was to killing. Yeah, we, we just have to we just have to fish for full para here. There's not really much else I can do. Finally! Alright. Alright, here I think we stack monkey and then go into Flygon Bait. I think... I th Wait, okay, so there are two things we can do here. One, close con... Wait, okay, so punishment is super effective. I think it's 80 power, so that's... So no, close combat is still stronger. So we can either swagger and hope for and do the parafusion. It doesn't really matter because you no, know, if it hits itself in confusion, it'll do big damage to itself. If it doesn't, we get a free sw we we get to uh, bring flag on bait in for free, and it will be able to get the kill anyway. I think swagger is actually the optimal play. Please. I know that we, we outspeed, and we probably kill. Alright. Alright, ju it's just the Aegis Slash now. I think the best play here is Heal Flying on Bait. Wrong, that wrong move. I forgot it was air balloon. I'm so dumb. Please excuse my dumbness. So I think we. Well, what I could do here is read a king's shield. That's what I didn't want to happen. I just thought it... Alright, so it wants to flash cannon now. I think my best play here is just pop the air balloon. We won't... We don't die to this. Alright. I don't want to risk a roll, so I'm gonna switch to Snoggy and predict the king's shield. Alright, so now we're... Alright, I'm gonna... Oh my. I don't know if that was the right play. I think it saw the true hit KO with Flash Cannon. We we've put it in an we we've put it in alright, it needs a crit, otherwise it can't kill me. We win. We won. I'll change state. Awesome. No, seriously, that was an awesome battle. Uh, oh, yeah. Thun Thunderbolt is very, very good. She's working. <laughs> Care to explain what you're working on? Alright. 
I'm not going to end the episode with just the gym battle. Well done, so we're going to go... So we're going to go ahead... And, oh, what a weird place to put a workshop. Wow, okay, it's 10. Yeah, that's why we're not going to end the episode here. We need- we kind of need some breathing room, not gonna lie. Alright. Dry bones. You died first. Then monkey died. The rest of my team, even though, is still alive. So let's see. We have a few. We have a few options for team members now. I think I know there's going to be an armored Zekrom, so I'm going to bring Wigglytuff onto the team. And I can't. I th I feel like the second team member slot is going to be between Cyclos and Kira. I th should we you all right I think gore I think gore it's so I'm gonna I'm gonna look at Gorbis's stats and then and then I'm gonna look at Gorbis's stats all right well I'm back with a trained up team. And you see, Kira, Kira and Tough Guy have been leveled up. So I'm going, I'm going to just real quick look up. I'm just gonna real quick look up what Tinge Team is, because we want we want to be as prepared as as we can. So he leads with a Grom pig. Okay. That seems to me like a crocodile lead will be my best move here. Probably as probably I should put I feel like putting Sash on Crocodile this this time is a good idea. Just in, just in case the Zekrom has something crazy. And just gonna check that it doesn't have anything like super heat or crazy. This team is very heavy on fire and dragon types. Alright, Tan, your commission is done. I'm liking being my hands up of, of it. Of it? I think it's off. I don't want to be involved with this creepy cult stuff anymore. One hundred... Uh, One million dollars has been wired to your, wired to your bank account. Agreed. That was alright. Now I should have made the suit I paid for. Very well. This armor has made... Has been made to your exact specifications. It'll increase the defensive stats of a Pokemon that wears it. I did a bit of research. The only Pokemon that fits your measurements is, well, Zakrom. Harmony told me that you had Kiran back in the Sunset City gym. Do you honestly expect me to believe you have Zakron too? But what if he does? I don't- I really don't care if you believe it. The truth is the truth. Great work. The arm- Remember it looks sturdy and functional. Incredible. I've heard stories about Zakron, but I never thought I'd see it myself. How is it that you've caught two legendary Pokemon? Most people have never seen one in their lifetimes. Master Balls. Lots and lots of Master Balls. I mean, Tate does have a point. <laughs> I don't try to coax or convince them to join us. Have you seen how the other cults operate? They just ask them to join us. No wonder they never succeed. Common sense, come on. A strong Pokemon ball is so much more effective than messing around. You do be having a point. Anyways, it seems to fit fine. Do you have all the other armors we commissioned? I uh, yes. Antasasia, hey. Alright, Twig, what on earth are you two doing here? 
How did you get in? I just walked through the door. It wasn't guarded or anything. <laughs> Good job, Orion. Oh, why are you here? That shouldn't be you be managing your gym. I came because my friend told me to. That was uh, your friend. You mean rush around, right? You again. Stay away from me and my pal. I don't know what you want, but you'll never put your hands on them. It really is adorable how brave kids are. I appreciate you coming, though. This saves me the trouble of finding Russia and myself. <laughs> wow. So, the whole child, the titan of the Unova region, Zekrom, the dragon of ideals. Now bound in protective armor, it is stronger and tougher than ever before. It's the perfect fusion of both Pokemon and machine. Zekrom joined you? Why would it choose to join forces like something with something like you? I didn't. I caught it. It's very easy to get a Pokemon to obey you once you've tamed it. Yeah, actually, that is very true. You're a monster. Then why don't you try and stop me? How about it? A double or nothing battle between the two of us. A duel between giants. Winner takes all. Unless, of course, you don't care about what happens to Zekro. I do care, but you have a suit of armor. This isn't fair at all. I guess not, then. What a disappointment. I'll be on my way. No, I'll do it. Rush around. Come out. I don't know what on earth your problem is, but I'll be gosh darned if you're going to walk all over me, too. Did you really just say that? Very well, Zekrom. Crush this worm. Rush around. Attack. Dude, 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 dude. We're not doing da any damage at all. Zekrom, this is getting boring. Finish it. Rush around. No, are you alright? To the victor go the spoils. It looks like an armored legendary Pokemon is able to take out an armorless one. That's pretty indicative of the power of these armors, if you ask me. Want to test that theory, Twig? No. Do you really think you can be the perfect combination of science and myth? Bring it on. I want payback for what happened in Helio City. Oh. Alright. Alright, oh, why did we have to get burned? <laughs> Level 60 outrage, oh my. Chill, Crocodile. I think it's, uh, I think it's pretty much better than Aerialist. We just need to be careful not to click this. Alright, this thing is Guts Flame Orb, which can be very annoying. And we are in a very bad position to deal with it. We have a burned Crocodile out. So it has Super Power and Facade. I can- I think of those moves, I- I- I can expect Super Power. Oh my god, okay, we're having graphics issues, guys. Alright, it has crunch though. Alright, tough guy is the optimal switch here. But I I think we might have to, to we might have to make a sack here though. I'm not sure how to deal with this luxury, it can't be status. I'm vi I apologize for the graphics issue. Alright. Alright, so it's not wider. So I I just need to do a bit of damage here because polarizer's the only thing who can live a hit. We, we, we used Flash Cannon. Alright, so it's going to Super Power again. If I can lock this thing into Super Power, then I can lower its attack to comfortable levels again. 
So you see, it's already doing less damage to Magnezone. Alright, it might... I, I just realized Screech was a terrible move choice. He... <laughs> that was just... That was completely well-deserved. Char's... Charizard. Okay, I think we can expect Earthquake here. I'm, I'm, I'm thinking we could kill Deku Tree and Takira. I think that's a reasonable move. The only thing that would be terrible, it Flare Blitz. What? Okay, chill. Actually, chill. I think... So, it's either going to... Uh, dr to Dragon Claw or Earthquake? I think Coil would protect us from both of them. Oh, Dragon Dance! Okay... <laughs> All right, this is a very yeah, interesting position that we're in. I'm working so hard to, here to make sure that our team doesn't die. We still have Focus Ash my cargo, so I think we'll be okay. I'm gonna heal Flygon Bait's burn now. Sorry, Kira. <laughs> We're, we're actually through most of his team, believe it or not. <laughs> so I think Dirt Attack is better here than Rock Slide, because... No, wait, but Dirt Attack may not kill from this range. Please, please hit. Let's go. Alright, let's see, so what moves does this thing have? It had it only has dragon and electric moves. If it only has dragon and electric moves, I know exactly the correct switch here. Alright, who alright, who's coming out? Kyurem. He's he lost. There's- he can't hit Polarizer. Alright, so it's going to spam Substitute. And it also has Ruse. Ruse is fine. So I think it's gonna Roost here. I need to- Wow, I- I- I'm like meta gaming this fight. <laughs> We're healing Flag on Bay here. If if we need to, we'll use an ether. Okay, good okay, that was a good move. <laughs> if I must say. Alright, now we're healing in Magnezone again. Fusion alright, it's oh it's I think I I think I saw fusion bolt. I think this is the perfect opportunity to get flood and bait in. Outrage probably won't kill us. Alright, it's 
I don't think Kyurem's low. Alright, I think the Ice Beam kills here. I can't. Well. <gasps> Alright, I didn't want to outrage myself. Alright, I'm gonna need to use an, use the ether here. <laughs> yeah, Tan's done. <laughs> There's nothing this thing can do. <laughs> okay. Oh my god. That was really stressful. Alright, we did it. Dot dot dot. The armor still seems... Still seems to still have a few glitches left to fix. It does not. I just outplayed you and out potion spammed you. It shows potential, but it's definitely not complete yet. Orion, is it? You want restaurant back? Visit the Dragon Roots near Selene City. That's where I'll be. Humanity and Pokemon are two sides of the same coin. Each can do unique things the other couldn't hope to try. If we combine the in the talents of both people and Pokemon. Perfection. Perfection could finally be achieved. Okay, I'm sorry, but what? What a nutcase. That's the craziest thing I've heard in my life. Selene City. Anastasia, aren't the ruins near Selene City the ones that are totally off limits? Yeah, which is why we need to go visit them. Alright, you're not seriously considering. I have to, Anastasia. I need to do it for Reshiram. It was my friend before I even knew it was a Pokemon. It supported me even when the entire city was against me. You're dead wrong if you think I'll abandon it now. That's a pretty speech, but are you going to actually get it back or not? Well, today was eventful. Yes, it was. Uh, listen to it. Don't judge me about the armor thing. I didn't know he was a cultist until today. I'd never even seen him before. And hey, if it helps any, I have a few prototype armor suits. They're not perfect, but they'll get the job done. Let me know if you're interested. I want that fan. Wait, is that a washing machine? It's a lawnmower. There, 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 there must be like a microwave. Some, there's a for. Oh, these are for Rotom. Oh my god, that was the that was the craziest episode yet. I think. <laughs> It also had the most potion spam out of every episode, which is a feat to be proud of. Kira, I'm, you were only here for a little bit, but you weakened the Charizard, and we will all be grateful to you. Daku Tree, I'm sorry. You were you were on our team for so long. You were you were one of the best members. And tough guy, you did absolutely nothing. Before I decide our next team in members, I'm gonna go get our encounter on the next route. I can't. So, and the survivors are Flygon Bait, Polarizer, and Snoggy. Minor graphical errors, such as the text, such as the text being modified. I mean. I kept. Well, everyone has a complaint about every single city except Helios City. All right, yeah, uh, yeah, Mega, not terrible. Yeah, 
Yeah, I knew that wouldn't kill because Mad Cargo is just not good. Like, Mad Car- Sorry, Mad Cargo is probably one of the worst fire types. <laughs> I think I might, I think I might add it to my team later, but not right now. Alright, so it's like a, I, I guess I'll name it. Dragonfly. I know it's very uncreative. It's, uh, well, I, I'm inventing new words, guys. <laughs> I'm gonna fish, I think. Or I could just... No, I didn't mean to surf. I'm... Finally! Okay, that's fine. I guess. I don't like full fish, though. We will have to... We, we do have to fight Zenith, so that's not a bad... Ca a catch. Come on. Why is... I get. I guess I'm probably just... I'm not good at the... Uh, I, I guess I'm probably just not too good at... No, okay, you know what it is? I don't want to kill it with something. So I'm gonna... I guess I'll flash cannon... If the game wants me to that badly. Alright, it's... Alright. Polarize is getting low, so I'll switch to fly gun bay. This thing could take down and kill itself, though, so I need to be careful. Alright. Alright. <laughs> it's supposed to be a balloon. Puff balloon. Yay! It, I don't know why I named it that, but I'm, I'm just really good at making names up for some reason. And I'm also apparently very good at walking around the PC by accident. So we're gonna rework our team to deal to be really good against Xena. Tinted lens, yeah, and Mega is actually kind of good. I think I'll, I'll I'll bring in Monster Truck as well. Oh, uh, so I. All right, I guess that's all I have for for you guys today. That was a very crazy episode. But I'll see you guys next time. I hope you're having a fantastic day. Peace.